<gasps> oh! Oh my god! Hey guys, magandang umaga or magandang gabi, depending on what time you're watching this video. My name is Monica and welcome to my channel. <laughs> okay, first things first, I want to address this look because it's not giving what I wanted it to give. I was following a TikTok tutorial where she basically smudged her mascara all over her eyelid and it just made it look like a really cool, like kind of grungy, smoky eye type of look. So if you are already a subscriber of mine, you will know that I try to theme my outfits and my looks to what I'm watching in my videos. So because today we are watching Cruella, we'll talk more about that in a second, I decided to go for kind of like dark look and I thought having the smoky eye would do it for me. I haven't decided if I like it yet, but I just felt if I continued to fiddle with it, it would just, it would go terribly wrong. <laughs> so this is what we're doing today, trying to go for the Cruella theme. Now today we are watching the Cruella movie, the live action with Emma Stone. I am quite excited about this actually. I kind of have a little love-hate relationship with traditionally animated movies going live action. I know that there is already a live action 101 and 102 Dalmatians, which I actually really loved when I was younger. So Cruella has just come out on Disney Plus and I think it's also in the cinema. It is playing on Disney Plus, but you do have to pay, I think in the UK, it's something like £20. I did drop that money so I can watch this with you guys. Any of you guys who are waiting for my finale of Shadow and Bone, it is filmed. I am currently editing it. If you've been keeping up to date with my community tab, you will already know all this. But without further ado, let's just get on with the reaction. <laughs> Ooh, it's black and white. Yeah, because isn't this supposed to be set in like... I want to say the 20s. I feel like I want to say the 20s for some reason. I don't know. And a red Disney with some lightning. Okay. From the very beginning, I've always made a statement. Oh, she was born with that hair. It's unfortunate. Oh. That necklace is the reason I'm dead. But I'm getting ahead what? of myself. Her name's Estella, not Cruella. Oh. Oh, it's going to be like another Cinderella thing. Her name is Ella, but then they called her Cinderella. It's funny because that style is like very common now. The hair color is a trend now. People love to do it. I like it, but she was made fun of it. Interesting. I am woman. Hear me roar. Well, that wasn't much of a thing back in 1964. 64? Why'd I think 20s? My bad. <laughs> <laughs> what is... I don't understand bullies. I really don't. But I found friends in unlikely places. Hello. I'm sorry, what? She likes puppies. Anita Darling. What a f Anita Darling! That's her! So she's gonna take Anita's puppies! Oh, come on. Her fits? Her different fits each time? I live! I'll be less trouble from now on, Mum. Promise. I don't think you're the problem. It's people who are picking on you and you're standing up for yourself. I don't think that's her fault at all. Wear it. It looks good. Wait, I'm sorry. Did, at the beginning of the movie, did she say she died? Is this like a Flynn Rider situation? This is the story of how I died. Stay in the car. I won't be long. Sometimes that dog looks real and sometimes it doesn't look real. Love you. Love you more. Love you most. Don't forget it. You'll regret it. Mother. So the Dalmatians are not nice to her. Those are the animated Dalmatians, man. <laughs> She's asking for money or something. Oh no! Oh my gosh! Are you kidding me? Why would a dog do they a dog would not do that? I think they were chasing someone. Such a ground! A dog wouldn't if they were chasing someone. I'm so, so sure that a dog would not just go and attack a, a random person. Oh, the necklace. So that's why she hates Dalmatians. Because Dalmatians killed her mom. Not about the clothes then? <laughs> why would she want to make clothes that had Dalmatian patterns on them in that case? If she hates Dalmatians and she blames them. No, but she doesn't blame them, does she? She blames herself. But she's got to hate them. Because she's Cruella de Vil. Oh, those are the two. Gregory House and Arthur Weasley. Oh, you scallywags! Scallywags! <laughs> Let 
Either they just dropped a dog from like a height, <laughs> or that's an animated dog. I feel like that dog is not real. It looks like a like a animatronics dog. Is that just me? I promise. Oh look, it's a TikTok transition. <laughs> Let's go, buddy. That dog is still alive. How many years has it been? Ten years have passed. That's an old dog. All right. Oh, go. it's him! I know that actor. I don't know his name, but I know things he's been in. These animated dogs. I <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Oh, it's her birthday. Happy birthday to you. Uh, this is an offer of employment from Liberty of London, entry level. I might have padded out your CV a bit, as in completely. We've all done it. it. Yeah, we've all done it. Everyone's <laughs> Oh, I like these shots. I really enjoy camera work where it's like you're seeing what the person is seeing as they're walking. I really enjoy this. And if they do it smoothly, you'd think with her really impressive fake CV that she would be getting at least a higher position job. Just because her CV was so impressive as well. Oh, she's gonna medal. Is she gonna rearrange the store or something? I like how she's kind of slightly offbeat. <laughs> oh, someone's gonna see that it's amazing. He's gonna be so close to firing her. Oh my gosh. She's gonna like it. She's gonna see the thing in the window. Is that how I think it is? Professor Trelawney? Nanny McPhee? It is! You're hired. <gasps> but she's gonna work her really hard, right? She's giving me Meryl Streep, Devil Wears Prada type of boss. <laughs> gonna be her standing there and this song is gonna play I bet at some point this song is gonna come back and it's gonna be her that's gonna be at the top a mannequin some fabric can throw something together oh Baroness needs looks so her job is literally just to create looks upon looks all day and see if the Baroness likes it that's kind of cool you're literally just letting your imagination wander wander sorry Baroness 65 in the window winter collection I noticed that gonna buy it oh she's a litterer we gotta know where the dog murdering comes into play here man <laughs> that's the same guy that's the same bald guy right maybe she only had one person to take care of and she failed dismally oh wow oh after admiring her she's gonna take it back is it the baroness's Dalmatians. She's gonna design a thing to that she can kill the Baroness's dogs. She knew your actual mum. Turns out that was her party we were at. Woo, small world. I knew I recognised that bald guy. It's the same dude. How did she not clock? She will recognise me. So Stella can't go to the ball. Cruella. I know someone who can. Cruella will! Is this the bit in the trailer she's gonna walk in? <gasps> oh! Oh, yes! Is that the dress she saw in the window? Giving me catching fire, the swirl with the fire dress, right? How does she know how to fight? Oh, oh. I'm so sorry. How is she taking them out so easily? It's just to get done. He recognizes her with her hair. It's not there. Oh, she's wearing it! No! What was your name? Cruella. Cruella. Knew it. Oh no! Such a brat. <laughs> oh, brilliant! Those dogs are gonna kill her dog now. Oh! She commanded the dogs to kill! I knew dogs don't just randomly attack! They don't! So she killed her mom! Oh no! Ah, you she gotta steal the dog now. That's why she gotta steal the dog so that she can have the necklace. Yeah, now you, you have to drive. I don't. I don't. <laughs> wow, you know what? I love the way that she's clearly hunching over because that's how Cruella Deville drives in the cartoons. They say there are five stages of grief: denial, anger, bargaining, depression, and acceptance. Well, I'd like to add one more. Revenge. Revenge. Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> oh. This attic, you just have enough money to be smashing each other's bowls and glasses. That's a no. If you have no, it is. No. Oh, she's just suddenly a bitch now. The necklace went in one end, yes? It's going to come out the other. That's how it works. She's taken on like a another personality. Anita, darling. 
the need to die. Team. And there is an iron imbecile, go. Hey, no, 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 you can't talk to us like that. We're helping you here. So don't. Why is she so mean to her friends now? I don't get it. Just suddenly she switched. Cruella was in a box a long time. Now Estella can be the one who makes guest appearances. So she's like got a secret identity now. <laughs> it's like a super villain. <laughs> oh, another. Future. Okay. Oh my god. She's just destroying every. <laughs> she took her moment. Did I step on your mom? Let me know. Should I stay or should I go? Come on, this soundtrack, guys. Oh! Oh! It's attached. That's her dress. Sick. Roger always blamed me for getting him fired. Wait, Roger. Does he marry Anita? Wow, the dedication by hand. We just have to get rid of this Cruella. She has made it me or her, and I choose me. Why does she look, she look kind of uh, shocked at that? Why would you pick someone else over yourself? <laughs> they really would make fabulous Kate. Oh, Stop. I'm joking. I don't think you are. <laughs> oh, what is that? Moths or something? They're all gone. They're either gone or destroyed. Destroyed! Wow. Oh my gosh! They're eggs! They were eggs! So he can play electric guitar? <laughs> Since when? There she is! Oh, wait! She killed my dogs and made a coat. She really did kill the dogs! You really are a psycho. That reminds me of the TikTok trend. You really are obsessed, obsessed. aren't you? Kitten. <laughs> I'm going to jail. For what? Your murder. Oh. Oh, so I die because of that necklace. Okay. Well, she's clearly not gonna die. She's the main character. She can't die. We've still got like 40 minutes left of the movie. <laughs> the dogs are alive. So she didn't kill the dogs. Is it the bold guy? Why do I feel like it's gonna be the bold guy that saves her? Did she really die? I don't think she did. She can't. I know I've seen a picture of her with like really smudged makeup. Ah! I knew it! The necklace! Is it clean? Did you clean it? <laughs> were they a couple? I feel like they were together. Or is that her dad? Imagine if that was her dad. You are her daughter. Oh, that's why they didn't show the face. Cruella was being born. They didn't show the face of the mom. This is what I've seen. Her, her makeup like this. Not sweet, Estella. I'm Cruella. Born brilliant. Born bad. And a little bit mad. How much do you want to bet that this speech was the audition speech for this role? <laughs> Another disguise? So she comes to rescue them. So do they feel like indebted to her? She's not going to be nice ever again. She basically said Estella's dead. So why would they continue to be around her? She's so awful to them. Do not be around people that are awful to you, by the way. Even if they used to be nice to you. If they're awful to you now, leave. PSA of the video. I've had enough of being treated like a dog, thank you. No, Good, thanks, leave her. I went a bit mad. I'm sorry. Okay, so I mean, if she's changing back, if she's... Being nice again, fine. But I still say, if you don't like the way someone is treating you, you have every right to walk away. I'm just gonna stick by that. There are only so many chances that you can give someone. The puppy killer, you didn't. I didn't. But people do need a villain to believe in, so I'm happy to fit the bill. Oh, so she's allowing it. That's where the story came from. They must steal the materials, because materials are expensive to buy. Or did she just get paid really well when she was working for the Baroness? These are cool shots. The slow motion of the sewing machine. That's cool. Over me! Do you know what this car's called? DeVille! A devil! <laughs> What's that? A taser? Hmm. She's gonna do it on him. Don't do it on him. Gosh. That's marvelous. 
competent. I feel like the dogs might turn on her. I feel like that might be her ending. Maybe she falls off the cliff. I beg your pardon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a th oh, it's like a memorial for her. So they're honoring her. Oh, but they all did the same hairstyle as well, though. Oh, she's got her classic shoulder points, the shoulder pads with the points. Classic. She might actually fall off the cliff. She's gonna Mufasa her. Hello, mother. Mother, do you need to be among your own kind? Me. No, but you just. She's trying to plead with her because now she's not in control of the dogs. She doesn't have her henchmen with her. She was gonna kill her, so don't even try it. I'm sorry. You are? No, she's not. I am. No, you're not. Can I hug you? No! What's she gonna do? Stab her, quite literally, in the back. She's gonna push her. She's gonna try and push her, right? But they have all the witnesses and she doesn't know. Idiot. Yeah. <gasps> <laughs> she tried to drag me with her. She jumped, she jumped, she jumped. <laughs> Who would you believe? Who would, Who would you, you believe? believe? And that's why she changed it back and she put her Estella wig on. Before she died, Estella willed her fortune to her dear friend, Cruella de Vil. So she, she actually made Cruella like a legal person? Well. Ooh. Oh, what is this? She's parachute to safety you know what would have been kind of cool is if they had set up like a parachute at some point else in the movie and then you would have been like oh that's come back round full circle i think that would have been cool all right we should put on some music or something Cruella Cruella de Vil. Vil. no they're not gonna play that so what now let's kill some dogs <laughs> oh oh we do have our theme song we have it someone covering it okay guys my birthday <laughs> My verdict on that movie, not a children's movie at all, I don't think. Like, I don't see any children enjoying this. The whole thing being about the necklace, but the necklace actually meaning something in the end, that was good. I'm happy that it wasn't like just a sentimental thing, but it was actually something that progressed the plot further on later on in the story. I really enjoyed that. I think some of the camera work was really cool. I love the outfits, the fashion part of this. It was very aesthetically pleasing. The outfits of everyone, all the characters, and also how the movie looked in general. I really, really liked it. I think it's really difficult to be making like remakes of movies or taking movies that we know and love from like childhood or from years ago and trying to do a spin on it. I think it's very difficult when Disney or any any company tries to do that because you can either remake it more or less exactly the way that the original movie is, kind of like what they did with Beauty and the Beast with Emma Watson. They kind of did the same thing. They added like a side story of like the plague and like a bit more about the beast's childhood and stuff, but more or less the story was exactly the same. And the same that they did with Lion King, more or less. But when they try and do something different with it, again, it's difficult because people might not be happy with the take that you're trying to do with it. I did enjoy Maleficent. I do really enjoy the villain as the protagonist type of story. And I think 101 Dalmatians was a good one, a good movie to pick and try and adapt because we don't really get any backstory from Cruella, so you can really let your imagination run wild with what you can do with her story, and that's what they did. I'm gonna stick this movie in my Disney playlist. So I have a playlist which I'll stick above right now, which is my Disney playlist. This will go in there. If you are someone who is waiting for my finale of Shadow and Bone, I said this at the beginning, but in case you missed it, it is coming. I have filmed it. I'm halfway through editing it, and it will be out shortly. But I think that's it for today's video, guys. If you wanted to hear more from me, my socials are also linked down below. That is my Instagram, my Twitter, and my TikTok. They are all at Monica Katapusan, the same as my YouTube name. And thank you guys for watching. If you stayed until this point, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys! <laughs>